What's up everyone, TJ Fitness Dealings Reviews and today I have with me the new Synfit Protein Cookie. There's been a lot of noise around this one. We're gonna try this one out. It's the birthday cake flavor and then we're gonna see is this really the best protein cookie out there today. Let's get right into it. So guys, Sinister Lab, I reviewed their uh, Synfit protein bars. I reviewed their protein spread, actually Gilad did, and now they came out with these cookies. Now they have three flavors, I have the two others coming up, so I'm going to do a separate review on the other two. But this one, this one, the birthday cake one, is the one that got all the glory during the Arnold, because that's the one that was launched then. And there's a lot of noise, because honestly the Synfit bars are one of the best bars out there, when it comes to like uh, meal replacement bars, you know, they're the 300 calories type bars. The cookies is only a natural extension, obviously, to the Synfit product line. You know, Synfit is represented, part owned by Flex Lewis, the bodybuilder, the 212 bodybuilder. And they've, they've got quite a reputation going for them as far as quality and flavor. So I'm excited to actually try it. I'm, I'm a bar junkie, you know, protein bars, protein cookies. I can literally go through the whole day just eating bars as long as they are good. As far as the cookie segment, you know, you have like, when you look at the protein cookie segment, you have the uh, Lenny and Larry, which started the category, but that's not, I mean, you get 16 grams of, uh, of, of protein there, but you also get like, I think it's 40 grams of sugar. So I'm not very big into that type of uh, cookies, the, at least the ratios on the macro stuff. They are very good. Now, the other ones like the Muscle Tech Cookie, the Pro Subs Cookie, I, I would guess these are the ones that you look at when you're comparing. And all of them are like 290 to 340 calories per cookie. You would usually see between 18 and 20 grams of protein. And then you would get like quite a lot of carbs, uh, like around the 40 grams carbs. So this one fits, fits into that category. So you, to a large extent, competes with the, my, the Pro Subs My Cookie, the Muscle Tech Cookie. Uh, as far as the actual macronutrients on this thing, so you have... 310 calories on this cookie and then 12 grams of fat uh, 20 grams of protein which is more than the prosops my cookie and the muscle tech cookie which have 18 so 20 grams of, of uh, protein and 35 grams of carbohydrates seven grams out of them are sugar three grams are fiber this is an actually very similar profile to the prosops my cookie and the muscle tech i mean give or take a couple of grams of fat and a couple of grams on the protein. As far as the uh, what the promise is, it, that it's supposed to taste obviously good, but also to be soft. Some of the cookies are just a bit more chunky and they're not really soft. We're gonna see what this thing is. So let me show you, this is the package. This is how it comes, right? There's a, you can buy them separately or you can buy them in a box of 12. So as far as the texture or the size, let's start with the size. So this is the size of the cookie. Right? So it's way smaller than a Lenny and Larry cookie. You know, the Lenny and Larry cookie are like this. And it fits, like this is this is the size. So it's very similar size to the Muscle Tech uh, uh, cookie, but it's thinner. The Muscle Tech cookie seems, feels chunkier. So this is, this is thinner. Um, you can see that there's a lot of icing and coating on the birthday cake. It does look like a birthday cake. There's a lot of uh, sprinkles and whatever. So we're, I'm going to try it now and we'll see, like, does it, does it uh, measure up to the competition? So let, let's give this one a shot. So it's better than the Lenny and Larry birthday cake, honestly. It's sweet. It's really good. Like, is this amazing? Like, I, you know, I would choose this. I would pay double the price compared to anything else. No, I think it's okay, honestly. Like, it's not, it's not overwhelmingly better. The Synfit bars, at least when they came out, when you compare them to the other protein bars around the 300 calories, there were some of them were really good. This is really good, but like, if you compare this to a one bar, like birthday cake one bar, I think the one bar birthday cake is better. This is a bit more similar in flavor to the Quest birthday cake bar, which is good. I mean, again, like this is good. Now, my biggest problem is there's, there's how many grams? So there's uh, 78 grams and 310 calories. You know, like the one birthday cake uh, bar has 60 grams and uh, 220 calories. The Quest is also 60 grams, but it's like... Um, 170 calories depends how you count the fiber 
So again, you'll pay like a lot of, I mean, there's a lot of carbs here. So you'll pay a lot of carbs. The protein comes from a protein blend, like a mix of uh, concentrate and isolate and a couple of others. I mean, it's good. It's good. I would say this to summarize, like as far as texture, this is the softest cookie I've tried. This is way softer than the Muscle Tech one. It's also softer than the, um, the Pro Sub Smile cookie. It's softer. As far as flavor, it's good. It's not amazing, honestly. Like the Synfit ones were, were better and I still prefer the one bar birthday cake flavor. As far as macronutrients profile, sort of on par, a bit more protein, but also a bit more fat, let's say compared to the Pro Sub Smile cookie. So I would say it's okay. There's, there's a bit of a coconut type aftertaste to it, which I actually like coconut. I don't know where it's coming from, but it's nice. It's, it's good. Again, I'm not blown away, but it's really good. Listen, as far as pricing, $25 for 12 cookies. So that's about the average price based uh, like compared to the competition. It's about the same. I would say if, if, it, if you run into a deal and we will hunt it down if there's a deal because that's what we do. We hunt deals. Then give it a shot. I think you're going to like it. It's, it's a very good cookie. Listen, people, if this video was helpful in your cookie decision making process, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel to see more reviews like this because this is what we do here. We take the bite of the cookie. So you don't have to take a risk. And if you want to save money, you know where to go.